ఆల్ ఆఫ్ యూ గుడ్ ఈవినింగ్ నమస్తే వెల్కమ్ టు అవర్ యోగా ఇన్స్ట్రక్టర్స్ కోర్స్ థియరీ క్లాస్ కండక్టెడ్ బై స్వామి వివేకానంద యోగా మంచిర్యాల్ తెలంగాణ విచ్ ఈస్ అఫ్లియేటెడ్ టు వ్యాస ఏ పార్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఎస్ వ్యాస యోగా యూనివర్సిటీ బెంగళూరు సో దిస్ ఈస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ క్లాస్ ఫర్ యూ బిఫోర్ అవర్ సెషన్ స్టార్ట్ విత్ ప్రేయర్ సిట్ ఎరెక్ట్ క్లోజ్ యువర్ ఐస్ the eight step method of asana teaching is very important for your examination and also future exams okay okay sir right so today we are going to learn about a beautiful a wonderful asana first step seven points the first point name of the asana is the sarvanga asana meaning of the asana is sarva means all anga means parts asana means posture justification of the uh, asana is the inverted pose category of the asana is the cultural type of the asana is the supine complementary of this asana is machyasana counts are eight in second step three points are there the first point silent demonstration second point silent demonstration with counts third point silent demonstration with counts with breath with explanation come to stiti legs together stretch the both hands above the head silent demonstration in the second step we have three sub points first point is over silent demonstration now second step demonstration with counts get ready 1 2 char panch che in second step third sub point count with breathing with explanation stiti ready to do one partial inhale raise your both legs at 45 degrees two full inhale raise your both legs 90 degrees three take the hind side of the body and with the both palm support raise your body this is viparita karini partial exhale with the elbow support with the shoulder support with the palm support 
raise your body in viparita karini and chatwari complete exhale stretch the both legs try to touch chin to your collar bone you should maintain from chest to toes 90 degrees normal breathing face is a smile pancha partial inhale come to viparita karni position shata full inhale slowly down your body with the support of both hands Sapta, partial exhale, down your both legs up to 45 degrees. Ashta, complete exhale, down your both legs, relax in, in Shavasan. Now, third step, benefits and contraindications. Gita Mena Chaptara, what are the benefits? Uh, benefits such as this are enhance the blood flow in the reverse uh, reverse blood flow sir. Um, toes side toes to head work active uh, strengthen out the body. Uh, hypo and hypothyroid activate uh, thyroid gland activate out uh, breathing improve the breathing elements. Breathing improve the lungs capacity. Back strengthen out the back muscles back nerves and strengthen out the sir. Uh, heart problem ki risk of heart problem heart problem sir rib cage improve the rib cage sir strengthen out on sir rib cage good varicose veins varicose veins varicose hernia problems piles piles in the pc body menstrual disorders okay so in one word the sarvangasana means it's uh, activate all parts it's a strengthen total body Contra indications? Contra indications? Contra indications? Hypertension? Sir, heart problem? Sir, cervical spandulosis? Sir, back pain? Okay, good. So these are the benefits and contra indications. Now fourth step: uh, individual practice. The instructor will give the instructions, demonstrator will do the demonstration. Individually, all the students practice uh, Sarvangasana. If there is any corrections, the teacher will come nearby the students. And uh, is there any mistakes uh, corrected by the teacher? Okay. Fifth step, pair practice. All the students please divide in two groups now malleshwari maunika ramya garu is the a group ashok garu shailaja nivedita garu is b group so a group is performing just b group observe if there is any mistakes please correct a group is performing B group is observing. If there is any mistakes, please correct them.
ओके सो इज दी मिस्टेक्स प्लीज आन्यूट अंड करेक्ट दम अशोक गार शैलजा गार निवेदित गार अन्यूट Ashok Gar is correcting Ramya, I think. Because the bracket is there, sir, perfectness. Where is the mistake? Ashok Gar, where is the mistake? Perfectness, sir. Okay, there is no perfectness. Okay, there is no perfectness. Next in Sarvangasan. Okay, next. Next, Maleshwari Gar, Shailaja Gar. Okay, there is no perfection. Okay, nice. Next, uh, Maunika Garu, Nivedita. Okay, okay, there is no perfection. Okay, nice. Now, B group perform, then observe the A group people. B group is Ashok Garu, Shailaja Garu, and Nivedita Garu. Here, Ramya Garu observing Ashok Garu, Maleshwari Garu observing Shailaja, and Maunika is observing Nivedita. Please continue. Only Sarvangasana we are learning today. B group is performing, just you observe the A group. If there is any corrections, is there any mistakes, correct them. Shailaja Garu, turn your body. Okay, no problem, no problem. No problem. Okay. Is there any correction? Please unmute and tell them. Okay. Nice. What about Shailaja? Maleshwari Garu. Okay, she is unable to do Sarvangasan. Nice. Next, what about Maunika Garu? Not uh, 100%. She is shaking. Okay, she is shaking and not maintaining 90 degrees from Neck to toes. Okay. Relax. Relax. Nivetita Garu, relax. Next step. Key points. The demonstrator will be the demonstration. The teacher will give the instructions. With the showing of the posture. Then the key points will be explained by the teacher. Legs don't bend the legs. Your legs are straight. Uh, don't uh, apart your uh, um, feet. Okay. Gently move smoothly, rhythmic, systematic. With the syn uh, synchronization breath, you move. Final posture. In the final posture, you should not move your body. You should maintain sthiram sukham asana. Face is a smile. Try to maintain from neck to toes 90 degrees. Don't bend your knees. Don't legs apart. Like that. Okay. When you are coming back, smoothly come. Systematic rhythmic synchronization with the breath. Smoothly come back to the. So these are the key points. Okay. Now say uh, seventh step. Uh, whole group practice. Whole group practice. The demonstrator will be the demonstration. Teacher will give the instructions. And uh, all group practice, uh, the teacher will come nearby the students if there is any mistakes from the students and corrected by the teacher. Okay. 
the eighth step question and answers and closing prayer okay is there any questions sir what is the difference from sarvangasana and viparita karmi viparita karmi your trunk is 45 degrees to the mother earth your legs are 90 degrees to the mother earth your trunk is 45 degrees to the mother earth your legs are 90 degrees to the mother earth in sarvangasana you should maintain your trunk and legs 90 degrees to the mother earth okay okay sir okay. is there any doubts no sir i am asking one question yes explain about pair practice pair practice annapudu group rendu ga divide chestaru sir class lo unna members ni batti two groups ga divide chesthe first a group perform chesthe b group vallu vallani chusi em mistake chesaranu vallu cheppali tarvata next b group vallu chesinappudu a group vallu vallu a four part chesaranu veelu cheppali sir a group vallu what is the duty of demonstrator and teacher here demonstrator and teacher come to nearby the students if there is any correction from the students corrected by the demonstrator and teacher there is no demonstration Both are, sir. okay there is no demonstration understand understand sir. okay so uh, this is the eight step method of asana teaching very important uh, method it's uh, scientifically proved one research have been done through the svasa yoga university bangalore this is the best method to understand the asanas thank you okay. namaste okay, dhanyavad okay thank you sir thank you sir thank you